This is my rock carvings relocation guide for Red Dead Redemption 2. Rock carvings are large designs engraved into stone that you need to find throughout the world to complete geology for beginners. This mission begins when you speak to Francis Sinclair, a stranger seated outside his cabin to the northwest of Strawberry. You can see me speaking to him now and gaining the mission. In this guide I'm going to show you all 10 locations of the rock carvings and if this is the first mission that you've done, the first collectible mission sorry that you've done, you'll also unlock the collector's item trophy which is um, for completing any one of the missions that require you to gather special collectibles. If you do use this guide to help you with these, uh, please do hit the like button, I'd really appreciate it. And if you want to see more of my Red Dead Redemption 2 content, do check out this video description. I've got all of my links in there linking to other content that I have done. And you can also hit subscribe if you want to see some more content from myself. Little rock carvings. Yeah, exactly. Little rock carvings. What do you want to do with them? Well, it's sort of very complicated. And you'll think I'm jazzed if I tell you. You can do these rock carvings in any order that you choose. But I'm starting with the one on the southwest shore of Owengila Lake. The second one is near the peak of Mount Shan and you can find this by going to this location on your map. The third rock carving is on a cliff that overlooks the Burns Out settlement. It's just southwest of the Horseshoe Overlook. You'll find the fourth rock carving at the very top of Mount Hagen, which is in the Grizzlies West. Rock carving number five is on a ledge just beneath the cliff edge, almost directly above a rope bridge spanning the Dakota River. Just head to this marker on the map where I show you here and just look out for the bridge down below. Um, uh, just there, as you can see on screen now. Uh, once you see that, you know you're good. It's quite easy to get. The sixth rock carving is on a rock ledge a few steps to the north of a, of a wooden bridge that runs across Wineyard Street. It's just north of Window Rock.
Rock carving number seven is on a rock ledge near the top of a tall cliff overlooking Dakota River. Just head to the marker that you can see on screen now and uh, I try and give you a little scope out of the area here. It's quite difficult to find where you got to go but you're near these two trees. Let's have a look around. They went in a circle. You want to head through here between the two peaks and the rest is easy. The eighth rock carving is on the edge of a plateau that overlooks Heartland Overflow. If you head south from Moonstone Pond, it's easy to get into this area. Rock carving number nine is near the east shore of the Elysian Pool. The final rock carving that I'll show you is on a rock ledge close to the top of the Roanoke Ridge, directly east from the Deer Cottage. After this, be sure to carry on watching the video as there's a few more steps you need to take in order to complete the mission. You need to send all the locations to Francis via a post office. This can be any post office. I'm here at the one in Valentine. But yeah, just head to a post office and get them all sent over. Be with you momentarily. So what would you like to send? May I help you? We'll get it there safely. This will get to them promptly. Thanks for your assistance. Once 24 in-game hours have passed, you can go back to any post office to receive your awards. One reward is an invitation back to Francis's house. We've got a train pulling into the station real soon. I'll be tending to you shortly.
head back to Francis's house to complete the mission. Thank you for watching, and if you did find this helpful, please do hit like. I really do appreciate it. And if you want to see more Red Dead Redemption 2 content from myself, please do hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications if you want to know when they go live. Thank you again for watching, and until the next video, peace out. Hello? Hello? Mr. Sinclair? Hello? Can I help you? Oh, I'm sorry for intruding. Uh, Mrs. Sinclair? Yes? How did you know? I'm looking for your husband. My husband? Yeah. He's dead. He's been dead since just before Francis was born, one year ago. Your husband, Francis, is dead? No, this is Francis. My husband, Tom, is dead. I'm a little confused. Yes, I think you are. What was your name? Uh, uh, that's not important. Excuse me.